Hey, great morning. This is Dean Kantai from DeanKantai.com. A quick message for you this morning as you start your day. One of the things about progressive thinking is that um, there's definitely an idea or, or notion that you can be better tomorrow than you are today. I think a lot of people embrace this regressive type of thinking where um, they're not wanting to put themselves in a place of growth, growth or evolution or put themselves in a place of, of stretching themselves, whether it be physically, spiritually, mentally. One of the key items of living a life of abundance or living a life of freedom, both um, in your personal life and monetarily and spiritually and emotionally, is um, the idea that you can uh, live on the edge, essentially, that you can go out of your comfort zone and do things that don't restrict you from your ideal values or beliefs. In other words, thinking about your life a little bit differently than what you've been doing it. And, and one of the things that I try to embrace with myself is establishing that baseline of saying, Dean, you know, you've been here, you've done this, you've done that. What haven't you done? What more can you do in each area of your life? How can you stretch your thinking, one, and then stretch yourself by, by way of action. And through by stretching yourself by way of action, again, doing things outside of your comfort zone, doing things that um, you wouldn't do, you, you haven't done before, and doing things that um, allow you to stretch this idea of who you think you should be. You know, it's very clear to us what's worked for us in the past and what hasn't worked for us, and it's very clear to us what we're doing now that we did in the past that's not working for us now. So the key is to look ourselves and be honest with ourselves, look ourselves in the mirror and be honest with ourselves and say, how can I progress my thought process or progress my ideals in this one particular area? Or how can I see things differently than what they are? This all goes back to pushing those limits and living on the edge. So one, establish the baseline for where you want your life to be. This is, the baseline is here of, of, of the quality of life that you want to have, spiritually, mentally, monetarily, family love, etc. And then looking at where you can go. And in between here is where you need to stretch ideals, stretch yourself, uh, get into action, um, change some modes, change some routines, change the circles of people that you hang around change the books that you're reading, change how much TV you're watching, whatever it is. The second piece is unforcing yourself to be stuck in the same place, right? Spinning your wheels or in this continuous loop of scarcity, in this continuous loop of fear, in this continuous loop of excuse of why you are where you are, why you haven't moved on. And three, understanding what the action steps are and taking action. So if we know these certain things or these type of behaviors or these thought processes aren't serving my highest good, they're not giving me the kind of results I want, then we need to radically shift how we're thinking about what we're doing in our life across the board. Thanks for tuning in and listening to my message today. That's my word. This is Kuntav Talk, love and gratitude.